I would like to introduce Thomas Sepp, Secretary for the City Council in Tallinn, responsible for all administration jobs. And uh, his presentation here in the Congress has led us to new era. I would like to say you called it Tallinn Virtual Service Hall. Could That's you right. Explain <laughs> us what exactly it is. Actually, it's uh, going back to our uh, service uh, uh, services, and we we thought um, there is a new age coming: uh, internet age, internet people, internet child. Uh, they are all coming, and um, uh, for them, it's much more easy to reach our services through internet. And we uh, discovered, we first founded how many services we are in the city, what we are offering for our citizens. It was more than 500. So we mapped them all, and when we started to think uh, uh, what kind of services might be delivered via internet, not to leave, uh, leave your home through, through internet. And uh, we discovered that there are at least half of them you can apply different subsidies, allowances, uh, some uh, uh, regulations. You can get uh, these services from your home. Why, not, why to uh, go by bus somewhere? It's, it's much easier to get these services from your homes. But it also creates some questions. First of all, don't you afraid about the hackers' activity, for <laughs> example? Hackers are everywhere, they stay everywhere, they uh, will be more competent, but uh, actually we are not afraid of them. Uh, why I'm saying so, uh, we are using electronic voting already, internet voting from homes. And uh, when in the first elections we had 1.9% of all votes uh, gave, uh, gave by the uh, internet, through internet, from homes, from workplaces. Okay. Now it, it came into a 16% in the last elections. And we hired hackers to uh, go into a system okay. so, so where they, they not succeeded. So it's not <laughs> your task to provide all services through internet? No, uh, that's, uh, that's, that's not possible because there are always some kind of soft issues like uh, uh, social work, uh, that's, that's impossible to do everything through internet. But some things are much more easier reachable and much, much more better to uh, reach by our citizens. Okay, so uh, reaction of citizens of Tallinn, are good for this innovation or not? What is uh, their relation to this service uh, served mm -hmm. by internet? Uh, I think uh, our country is um, <coughs> different uh, from others because our people uh, trusting internet. So uh, we have 1.1 million uh, IT cards for, uh, through which you are uh, going into these services, identifying you first. And we have 1.3 million inhabitants. So almost everybody, I'm not talking about babies and uh, two, two old, old people. But uh, this is, uh, uh, and they have a uh, knowledge how okay. to use it. They have infrastructure, and uh, more than 67% uh, uh, of Estonian uh, households having uh, uh, internet access. Well, it's uh, more than 50%, <laughs> and, more than 70%. And, 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 and last, also a structure. Young yes. people probably support you. But and, 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 last, and last uh, fact, this is uh, uh, our, in our country, uh, uh, Ninety-two percent of all tax declarations were sent electronically. So, if people trust their money, why uh, why not? Uh, they uh, don't trust uh, any any other things. Okay. So, Thomas, I can congratulate. <laughs> you. Such a very good idea. Thank you. Thank you very much. All the best, and enjoy our club. <laughs>